Here's a quick workout for your hips, your groin, especially this inner thigh and your upper body. Get some energy restored. It's a great thing to do first thing in the morning. Get up out of bed, drink a glass of water, and bam, get to it. Don't sit around, don't sit. Get your body moving. Five, eight minutes, that's all it takes. So you wanna find a weight that is light enough, but heavy enough that you will strain. You wanna get in a squat position, and you wanna stretch one side to the other. Do that four to eight times each leg. This is gonna build hip mobility. We have too many hip replacements. You wanna keep your chest up and your head up, back straight. After you do that, you wanna go into quick, a deep squat. You'll find that it feels light because you just took the weight away. Use a five, 10, 20, 30 pound weight, whatever you need, and just do these until you feel a burn, don't kill yourself. 10, 15, 20, 30, whatever you feel comfortable with. But you wanna work those hip flexors deep. After you're done there, you wanna grab a light weight, stand tall. I stagger my feet like this, so to stand this way, it just gives me more support. You wanna bring your arms up and out. Do that eight times. You may feel some crackling in your shoulders. It's okay, you're working out those tendons, those ligaments. After you do that eight times, you're gonna go into jumping jacks. The reason you do this is you wanna get energy. You can jump rope or just jumping jacks. The key is you wanna keep your arms near your ear or behind your ear. Do this for one minute. So you're gonna need a clock or a timer or count 60 to 100 reps. After you do that, your heart rate, rate will be going. More blood flow. Next, you wanna get a weight and go into a real deep lunge. You wanna hold this and then do some curls. This is balance. This is brain power. Balance and energy, it takes a lot of energy to balance. It takes a lot of coordination, muscle strength. Do that eight times, pop up, go down to your other side. This is a great upper body, leg, hip mobility, full body motion. And then you're gonna do one more exercise after this. Do you do eight? You wanna stand tall, leg straight. You wanna bend and roll back up. So you wanna bend, roll back up. Feel like your back is just rolling. Just like that. So if you do that, if you do this every morning, especially when you get up, you're gonna stimulate blood flow, lymphatic flow, healing, energy, cerebral spinal fluid that nourishes your brain. 90% of your brain gets nourished from movement in your spine. If you're not moving, you're dying. You gotta move, stay adjusted, hydrate, do your spinal exercise in the morning and get moving. You do that every morning, you're not gonna to want to because you're gonna get out of bed, you're gonna feel a little stiff, feel a little tired, you're gonna say, oh, I don't wanna do this. I'm gonna just sit down and read, let me have my cup of coffee. I encourage you to take five to eight minutes and just try this, just try it. Just get up, put some loud music on, put a headset in, that's what I do, and I jump around. Just get, just get fun, just jump. Just do like the old aerobics, just jump. 
just move. What that does, that bouncing creates energy. That bouncing creates healing. You want to be alive today. 